Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you for coming over to my channel and joining me here today. I thought it would be a great day to share with you what I've been doing here at home uh, in terms with stickers. Uh, recently, I got a silhouette machine, a Portrait 3, and I went ahead and jumped into Etsy, which is one of my favorite places to look for stickers. And I found some printable shops and I went ahead and bought some to try them out and I've been very very pleased with the results that I have been getting here at home and not to mention that it's a very affordable option if you are in a budget for stickers so without any further ado I'm going to go ahead and start sharing with you some of those shops that I have found so far and what I've printed here at home and yeah so first off I'm going to show you, let me move this hot cocoa from here. Okay, so first off, I have from Print Plan. And she has this adorable character. And I got uh, five sets just to try. So in each of the documents that she sends you with purchase, you get like a sampler sheet and then you get an individual sheet with the actual icon or character. So this one is for Happy Mail. And here is the sampler with the icons that I got. And I just love the design. And another thing that I love from print and plan specifically is that you don't have to print the four of them if you don't want to she she offers an option for you to choose specifically what sheet you want to print so you are not printing something that you might not need so i thought that was really neat and i really enjoyed that so the other one i got is this one again very adorable this is for a working laptop you can use it for many things next I got this one for Disney Plus and I absolutely love so yeah And this is the last one that I got from this character. So this one is for birthdays, as you can see. And her character is very adorable. So yeah, so those are the four uh, pages that I got in terms of character. And then I went ahead and got this for technology so here you have an iPhone and an iPad and an, an iMac and I also like the how she includes different sizes for this one you just don't get the big one you get the big one and then a smaller one so it can fit in your planner without any hassles so yeah this one I absolutely love and I actually have been using those uh, this one specifically I have been using it a lot and that's another thing you just buy it once and then you have it so you can print it multiple times and you will always have it ready for you so you don't have to wait for shipping and all of that all right, so next, the other shop that I tried is called Blush and Indigo. And I have to say this one, I didn't have uh, good luck in printing. So I'll explain myself. Let me show you this one first. So this one, I absolutely love the colors, love the layout and the graphics. And if you, as you can see, it printed out really nicely i love the way that my printer handle it uh, i'm going to have in the description below the paper i'm using the printer i'm using and the cutting machine 
just so you have that information if you need it in, or you're interested in doing this at home. So this one looks really good. Okay, so again, no problems in terms of the, look, the way the graphics look and I really like the way it turned out and I will use this for sure. So here's a quick look of the layout and how everything turned out. You get lots of options which I really like that. And I'm sorry if I have a really noisy background. My kids are all around the house. It's 6 p.m. so yeah. Okay so you saw how this one looks. Loved it. Now the other one that I got from Blush and Indigo, I don't know what happened, or I should say, I know what happened. Instructions, and it's said to mark that I wanted a bleed uh, and, and something like that. I, I don't truly remember the exact wording, but if you can see around the actual pictures and graphics, there's like a blurry bleed mark this one doesn't have it so in this one i didn't follow the instructions for the bleed and it turned out really good but for some reason this one i don't i don't know what happened other than that that the graphics don't look that good and i know this is not on blush and indigo's part it was most likely my fault either on settings when printing or my actual printer. But nonetheless, I'm going to show you the kit because the kit is really beautiful. It's just the way that it printed out. It didn't work out for me. So you, as you can see, you can barely see that it says bill due over here. But I love the way that the gold leaves look. And here for the date headers, the icons and the date dots. It, it to be very frank it's just very bland and it doesn't have a background so again i am thinking this is on my part not on blush and indigo's part but for example the the deco and then the script that works perfectly fine here's this sheet I can totally use. This one I don't mind as much. The graphic doesn't look that bad. So I can totally use this sheet. Same thing with this one. And then over here in, on this one, I can probably use most of these. But in all, I will try to print it out again. I'm not 100% sure if I will just because I don't want to waste uh, more of the sticker paper and have it being a fail again. So I don't know if I'll do it again or maybe try again next year. But in terms of the graphic and the way that she designed the kit, I absolutely love. All right, so moving on, the next shop I want to share with you is Print Petticoat Bandit and I had two kits from her this is one of them this is blush and spice and the other one um, let me show you real quickly is the one that I use for this week's uh, spread so here you have a quick glance of the overall look of that kit and I absolutely love love loved it So going back to this one, here you have a good look. And I love how each and every shop has a very different way of laying things out. And they include so much. And the pricing is phenomenal. Uh, I think this was around $4. And I think I also got it on sale. So super cheap. And yeah. Look at that, that it looks so beautiful. I really love it. And I can't wait to try this one out. Look at that. That is stunning. I, I'm really happy with the way that this one turned out. 
And yeah. So let me show you till the end. I think this one I printed all of the pages except for the character page, which I wasn't really into. Yeah, you get some washi over here. It's just beautiful. I cannot wait to use this one. Choco, I got this one that's so beautiful and for this one you're going to see that I have this style and another style of her way of setting things up so this one was actually set up for you to print and cut the actual pages like this in, in these dimensions so here you have it you can get some deco you also get different skin tones and hair colors for the the planner girl absolutely love the washi look at that so pretty so you get a lot a lot for what you pay This one I got doubles because I don't remember if it was for I don't remember which sheet it was that I wanted the other part so I had to print the same thing double but that's okay so I don't have a problem with that so this is one of the layouts and then the other one which I absolutely love the graphic is this one and this one you're going to see that is a full page right and it did not come with cutting marks for you to uh, split it in half like the other one so in this one you get a full sheet but I absolutely loved it and I can't wait again I can't wait to use that like I really really wanted to get things that I knew I was going to use not just pay two dollars three dollars and buy something randomly so yeah that's what you get with Manning Choco Planerology Studio and for this one I got a few icons I got two for homeschool and they come like this and then the machine cuts them for you down the middle so you get two sheets in one document same with this one and I think I got another one oh yeah I totally forgot to pull that out. Let me go ahead and get it. Okay, so I knew I had gotten some more. So, my, my bad. I didn't pull them out. So, here we have movie time. Again, two sheets. And happy birthday, which I had already started to use. Which I absolutely love. And then I got four manicure time and this one comes in a four uh, split in four just like this so I love that she has a manicure on the top and pedicure on the bottom and yeah and you get different like nail polish icons which is good too also from Planerology Studio, I got this one. Now this one in the cut files, it does not provide a cut line to divide it into two, but that's perfectly fine. So I got this one, let me show you the layout. It has a beautiful color scheme. And yeah. And like the other ones, it does include a lot of stuff. And then you have some 
Echo, and you can also get German ones. It also comes with an extra page with the uh, fashion girls in big, uh, big squares, but I decided to skip on that page. Last but not least, I have this from Planner Shack, and I got a lot of icons from Planner Shack and also a kit. But I'm going to go ahead and start with the icons. Uh, in the files that you get, you get with words and no words, and I appreciate that. So I got a few. So here we have from cleaning, laundry, uh, desktop computer. TV bench, credit card, money envelopes for bills, shopping, happy mail, birthday, planner, workout uh, for dates, and then this one's that also come without words or with words. I got uh, went ahead and printed the recycling, clean kitchen trash, water plant, wash bedding, dust, cleaning, laundry, vacuum, declutter, clean bathroom, and wash towels. And I think I have more that I did not print out. So it gives you a lot of, of a good variety of icons for you to go ahead and print out. Alright, and the kit that I got last, also from Planner Shack, is this one that I absolutely love the colors. And I kind of see a theme going on here with the, the clip arts or the graphics that I chose for these kits to try out. So here are the full boxes. And I absolutely love this uh, double, double box and also the colors so here's the layout and this one was like three dollars or something i think i got it on sale so again i think overall on all that i show you i spent 25 dollars which is insane considering that a regular full kit runs you around 15 to 25 dollars for just a week's worth so i absolutely love this printing at home alternative so yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this video i absolutely love uh that i went ahead and decided to try out printables at home and I think I'm going to stick for a good portion of the stickers that I use for my planners. I'm going to go ahead and get them from printable shops and I will also get some from Planner Kate and Planner Bunny Press and all of those shops that I already love and I know. Alright guys, so that is everything that I had to show you for today. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Another thing that I forgot to mention is that some of these uh, shops also include the foiling files. If you have a foiling machine or you know how to do it with a laminator at home, you can also do that because some of them include the foiling file. If you like this video, please go ahead and like and also comment in the section down below if you have a printable shop that you have tried before and you absolutely love for me to check out once again thank you for watching and until the next time bye guys